Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you never miss a new video or a live stream and give me a big thumbs up at the end of the video. Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Shakisha Sims from Her Lovely Plan. Welcome to all my new viewers and subscribers and welcome back to all of my peeps that's been rocking with me since 2018. Yeah, I'm going to say that for a couple of more videos just because we're just into the new year and I feel it's only right for me just to welcome everybody and welcome everybody back because sometimes we get caught up in getting the content out there and forget to give shout outs to those who we're making the videos for and it's you guys and y'all are like the real MVPs for real. But anyway, I am here to do a plan with me in my 2019 classic vertical style happy planner that I am currently using for my business. Um, still trying to kind of figure out my flow with this. It's been a minute since I've used a vertical um, a vertical spread. Um, I was using a teacher planner, which is still somewhat vertical, but it had a lot of functional boxes to it. So I'm just trying to get reacclimated back to this particular planner style. Um, so just to kind of show you my spread for last week, um, I didn't do a lot of after the pen, <laughs> as you can see, because you know it's the beginning of the year. You just kind of reevaluating some things, seeing how things are going. Um, but now that I see the direction, the new clientele that I'm um, getting and, you know, preparing for things like taxes and stuff. I'm going to have a lot to write down these next few weeks. So this was last week's spread. It was very functional. I left a lot of white space, um, even though it doesn't look like it, but I really did leave a lot of white space just because I wasn't certain about what plans would have because I really didn't have any um, real plans for the business other than just, you know, making sure I had all of my products and things restocked and um, didn't do a lot of posting of pictures. I did some posting. Um, but again, you know, with business, beginning of the year is the year of review. Um, you just check in and seeing how everything goes. So, it's no need to keep chatting about that. And let's get right into the week of um, January the 7th through the 13th. Now, I'm participating in a collab video with um, uh, Sassy Bows and as well as I believe it is, um, I call her Triple P. I call her Triple P so much I can't even get her real uh, YouTube channel right. Pastry Pumps and Pie. Um, they're doing a collab. It's going to be pink and silver. So I'm going to attempt to make this all pink and silver because I like participating in group collaborations. Um, so let's see how I can make this thing pink and glittery. Stay tuned.
spread in my classic happy planner um, and as you can see I stopped the video and then I realized I wanted to cover up the calendar part um, just because it just was kind of like an eyesore um, and I was trying to color in these dates because the dates are like a bluish gray kind of color um, but it is what it is I'm actually not even bothered about by that it kind of gives it a little character but anyway I believe I stayed true to the um, collabo ration colors silver and pink it's kind of hard to avoid black I mean you know but I think I did good hopefully the girls will be happy with me <laughs> but just to kind of explain what I did and why I laid it out like this and I'm really satisfied like this week week two of January is really I'm winning on the planner spreads in my personal opinion so as I was doing this um well let me rewind because you know I've got to give you a little story at the end of my videos anyway so I've been starting to have planners remorse as I've been planning in my planners um, because it's just the way I thought it would go it didn't go but in my classic vertical I don't have planners remorse but I have um, been inspired um, to use this in a totally different way than I originally intended it was intended to be my business and social media planner then I switched to be my business and ministry planner but then I started to think because I really want to focus on growing my um, business and I want to focus on making sure that I am managing what's coming in and what's going out so I decided this is just strictly hair couture it has nothing to do with anything else so basically the way my rolls would work is the top row would be anything to have to do with the day-to-day -day, my website scheduling appointments um, any type of meetings that I need to go to or classes will go in the top box and then the second box would be all of my social media so um, like these ones would be days that I'll try to remember to at least post some pictures or post my availability um, since I don't go to work until Wednesday I can always do that on Monday or Tuesday um, depending on what my schedule looks like and then this bottom section will be strictly to track what comes in being an entrepreneur um, especially a hairstylist where you get cash from some debits from others um, you know it's easy to spend the cash and hold on to the debit so I want to make sure that I am calculating everything that's coming in because that's my income that I will then use to put into my budget planner so I want to make sure that I am keeping a track so that's why on Wednesday through Saturday you see these dollar signs because I will be tracking what I make and of course when I do my um, after the pen I'll probably be blurring those out just because you know my finances right now are my finances I'm not at that stage where I feel comfortable enough to put all of that information out there for the world but even with that being said um, this is just to kind of track um, any type of statistics or you know if I want to make a list of the products that I need I can put this here this is kind of like up in the air what I'm gonna use it for but I think I might put my supplies and then how much I pay to each distributor there and then here I will calculate how many um, clients I do a day um, and even though I don't have it like this I still can calculate it because at the end of the day your plan is your plan and you can make it function and operate how you want it to operate things don't have to be where everybody else tells you it should be as long as it works for you it works for you and me tracking my clients over here works for me so anyway this is my spread again it is pink and silver um, because I am participating in the group collaboration that sassy bows and um, pastry pumps and pies um, are doing for this week so you'll probably see the photo of this spread before you'll see the video um, because I try to stick to a specific schedule with YouTube um, but this will probably be posted in the collab group 
Um, so if any of y'all are in the group, you'll probably see this before the video. So anyway, with that being said, enough with the chitter chatter. This is my spread in my business planner. I'm very happy with it. I really feel like I'm gonna get a lot accomplished. This part probably won't be a lot of writing in here. Um, just because, like I said, this is just about my social media. I'll probably add more stickers throughout the week um, just to fill that part in. But other than that, it's, it's cute to me. So if you like this video, give me a big old thumbs up. And that's just to let me know that you're rocking with me, you're here with me, and you're liking what I'm doing. And also drop me a comment below with any questions or if you just want to give me some words of inspiration it's all good with me and while you're dropping a comment make sure you scroll through the description box because there's a lot of good information in that box um and i would hate for you all to say keisha you didn't tell me but i'm like it was in this um subscription box i can't so subscription i mean the description box <laughs> anyway so make sure y'all check out the description box um, so y'all can get all the information that I put in there and if you haven't already done so make sure you subscribe to the channel and most importantly click the notification button after you do that um, that way you'll never miss a new video or live stream that I typically do every Sunday so if you like this and it inspired you make sure you pay it forward and share this with your planner friends so they can also be inspired to create their own lovely plan so until next time planner fam peace Thank you again for watching Her Lovely Plan and I hope that you click that subscribe button and that notification bell.